your first alert forecast with meteorologist Chelsea Aaron. All right, beautiful day for us here today. Warm ish. I mean, warm compared to what we've had. This is basically pool weather compared yeah. to what we've seen. Sunny, uh, changing though. Yeah, unfortunately changing, but enjoy today. Right. Very spring like weather. I've been saying this uh, since the last week on Groundhog Day. I know Groundhog Phil said six more weeks of winter. At least for us, we are seeing beautiful warm conditions. Now we are tracking our next weather maker right around the corner. Usually this happens whenever we get a warm up we have a chance for showers, also even some storms in there. Good news is we really are not expecting severe weather. Maybe some gusty winds, heavy rain at times late tomorrow, overnight into Thursday morning. But again, that severe threat, extremely low, almost non-existent for us. It's going to be better out to our west southwest. Live look at Decatur this afternoon. We are seeing some blue mix in with cloud cover, but cloud cover will continue to increase as we head later into the day. Again, due to that storm system developing out to our west. The big story today. Check out these temperatures upper 60s, even seeing some 70 degrees out there. Decatur Molten right at 73. Honestly, feels quite nice today. I will say it's been nice to wear the short sleeves. Now we are dealing with some breezier conditions when gusts likely up to 15 miles per hour from the south. These will continue into your early evening hours, but likely calm down this evening. The stronger wind gusts, more breezier conditions will be headed your way throughout tomorrow. We might even need a wind advisor late tomorrow into Thursday morning. A few clouds and a few showers off to our west. This is all streaming in from that storm system out across southeastern Texas right now. Upper level low pressure associated with a cold front that's spanning all the way to the northeast. This will be headed our way likely within the next 48 hours. That's what's going to increase those wind speeds. Also bring rain back into the forecast tomorrow. Winds breezy still out of the south southeast. We will be looking at 15 to 25 miles per hour throughout tomorrow afternoon, but the gustier winds that arrives overnight Wednesday into Thursday morning, likely ending around daybreak Thursday. How high are they going to be? Well, likely upwards of 35, even 40 miles per hour as that cold front rolls through again, well below severe criteria, but still could cause some damage out there. So keep a heads up and make sure you're checking with our forecast throughout the next few days. Let's track that rain now throughout the rest of this afternoon. Rain free with temperatures peaking in the mid and upper 60s. We could see a stray shower late this evening, possibly some stray showers for your early morning commute tomorrow. But most of us looking mainly dry until that cold front sparks up more showers and storms later tomorrow evening overnight and into your Thursday commute. So again, make sure you take it easy. Give yourself some extra time for that Thursday commute. We'll be doing Facebook lives and we'll help to keep you safe throughout the next two days. We will gradually be cooler as we head into the end of your work week. Also your upcoming weekend back in the 40s for Saturday, maybe an isolated shower or two, but we dry out warm back up for the second half of your weekend and into next week. All right, Chelsea, thank you.